hello there, everybody. Uh, I wanted to make a quick video here uh, on LinkedIn automation. Um, I have a previous video that was one of my more popular uh, ones, and I know that that's been helpful for everybody in terms of um, loading prospects into a sequence and, and sending either messages to people you're connected with or connection requests to those you're trying to get in front of. Um, we'll do a, a very quick kind of uh, refresh here. So we have our sequence, right? Um, we have a connection request in step one. You can see here we have dynamic fields here. Now, this isn't crazy personalized, right? This is just a, we published an ebook. I know that you work on a specific chapter that we cover in the ebook. Um, would you like if I sent that over to you, right? So very straightforward. Now, in the past and in my last video, I had you guys in tasks here and we would click on each upcoming task. We would then click execute, a, a LinkedIn tab would pop up. Um, we would connect with that person and then we would complete and move on to the next. What Apollo did, which is really cool, and the reason why I'm updating this video for you, um, is they actually made this um, cool automation through their plugin. So you can see here, if we come over to our Chrome extension, um, plug in here and then click over to tasks, you'll see all of your LinkedIn tasks that are due. So instead of having to click through each profile and hit execute, come back, complete, move to the next, we can actually select up to 25 at a time, hit execute. Uh, they would like for us to stay on this tab, which is not a problem for me. Uh, and then you can see here, uh, I actually have two, I think two bad profiles in here. So it'll take just a second. Um, for this to start working for us. But you can see here that we're going to eventually, once my data is clean, uh, start loading profiles that are in our sequence and our uh, and that are due. All right, so this should help make your process a little bit more efficient, I hope. Um, and again, just wanted to update that last video because uh, I know a lot of you kind of lean on uh, these tutorials to get up and running. So thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Have a great one.